Hello guys, today we are going to look at the rules and regulations to write the computer based test for TSNZ 2019. Actually they have given with a user manual to know how to write the exam because it is the second time and you are writing it, this, it for the first time. Okay, so the user manual is going to uh, contain the rules and regulations and step by step guide to write the computer based test actually they are mainly concentrating on the reporting time okay you people need to the students need to uh, enter into the test center before two hours of the commencement of the exam and uh, uh, the candidates will not be allowed into the test center even if you are late by a minute after the commencement of the test and uh, you need to take care of your hall tickets and uh, id card for verification and uh, the black or blue pen okay with you and the hall ticket and id verification will be done at the entrance and you are going to be checked and allowed after complying with all the rules of the test and tsmz 2019 officials will take the your biometric and photograph before starting of your exam and uh, the invigilators at the test center will guide you to your respective computers or notes. In the in front of your test room, you are going to have a list of your hall ticket numbers as well as your respective system numbers. The system numbers will start with C and followed by triple zero or double zero with your system number. Okay? So at the scheduled time, the 10 minutes before the start of the test you need to enter your username and password as the instructor in the examination hall after entering your examination uh, username and password click on the sign in button and uh, for any system related assistance like any problem with the system and uh, if you are not able to type uh, entering uh, your hall ticket number or uh, your password uh, your username and password then you need to call the invigilator by raising your hand only and uh, they this system is basically uh, work with only the mouse no need of using any keyboard if you are going to use any keyboard uh, keys then it will be struck okay so be conscious that you are using only mouse to write this exam okay and the test will be like this okay the test screen will be like this this is the screen here you are going to have your photo and uh, here you are going to have your name and the subject you will be having okay and the system name here the system name will be c001 and c00010 c055 and all these things and if you have any problem in this photo or name or anything else you need to contact your invigilator and here you need to enter your hall ticket number and username and uh, password they are directly entered okay and uh, you can select your language to write the test okay so i am selecting here english and i have already entered the username and password and i am clicking on the sign in button right so the exam will start now here you are going to give with uh, instructions general instructions first read these instructions thoroughly and uh, later on you need to go on to the writing of the exam to read in these instructions you are going to give in with uh, 10 minutes of time in that 10 minutes of time you need to read each and every instruction carefully and uh, you need to start your exam okay so the total duration of examination is 180 minutes as we know and the clock will be set by at the server not at the your system and uh, you are not going to change any clock any time with you uh, okay the countdown timer in the top right corner of the screen okay will display the remaining time available for you to complete the examination when the timer reaches zero the examination will end by itself you will not be required to end or submit your examination the question palette displayed on the right side of the screen will show the status of each question using one of the following symbols will be available at the right screen okay so there are list of questions okay and uh, the question numbers are going to have with them color code okay this is the color code which is going to say that you have not visited the question h and this is the color code 
you have visited the question but not answered for that question and this is the color code which mention that you have answered the question and uh, with purple circle you have not answered the question but uh, marked the question for review and purple circle with uh, some green color tick uh, okay the question answered and marked for review will be considered for the revaluation these are the five color codes you need to remember while writing your tests and uh, there are some other things you need to consider you need to read in carefully okay and next thing is click on next button okay and here you are going to give with uh, uh, question paper contents okay this question paper is going to contain three parts mathematics physics chemistry mathematics is going to have 80 marks and physics and chemistry each are going to have the 40 marks you will be given with uh, 180 minutes to attempt 160 questions there are no negative marks and questions will be available in two languages english and telugu and uh, click on this checkbox before starting your test okay and uh, click on i am ready to begin all right here mathematics physics and chemistry okay and here 180 minutes okay and uh, M set uh, engineering stream here and uh, here you can have with the zoom in and uh, zoom out controls if you are not able to see the question properly then you can zoom into the question and as uh, you can zoom out of the question okay and uh, this is the question here you are going to have the question and options you need to select one of these options okay and here you are going to have the question palette question number palette okay so uh, mathematics have 80 questions so 80 questions are here okay and uh, 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 okay so if you want to visit the uh, 10th question click on the 10th question directly and look at the first question it is not answered okay and uh, fifth question you have visited and to save your question to save your answer you need to click on save and next then only it will be turned to green as answer okay if you have clicked on the ninth question directly one second if i am going to select one option here for ninth question and i have selected a 14th question the ninth will be not answered only remember this thing very carefully you need to if you want to save your answer you need to click on save and next only okay so like this you can have and in between you can go for physics test and you can go for chemistry test and you can come back to the mathematics or you can move on to any section in between and you can write in this 180 minutes okay and uh, after completion of the 180 minutes you need uh, the system will directly submit your test okay so answered okay now i am going to discuss about the mark for review okay so the 15th question is marked for review but not answered okay and the 16th question what i'm going to do i'm going to select uh, an answer okay and i got something wrong okay i got to know that it is not the correct one i am assuming that so i am saying that mark for review and next okay so here the 16th question is marked for review but answered okay so like this i can have the different different uh, things for mine okay so uh, let me go for the second question again and uh, answer and uh, if i don't if i don't want to save this one so clear response it will remove the answer thing for me okay so like this i can have the uh, write the question write the exam and i can answer i can mark for the review and i can answer and mark for the review and all these things i can do in the examination thing and i can check for the question paper entire question paper at once by clicking on the question paper 
okay and I can check for the instructions again if you may want to have and uh, uh, here the chemistry exam physics exam and uh, mathematics exam all these things I can have here okay thank you very much guys stay tuned to my channel